Here's the thing about college. When you go to college your first year, my advice is stay on campus, maybe a dormitory, and also get a meal plan. It's a really big change in your lives, especially the academics that you're going to pursue. You don't need any distractions, so your first year you really need to focus and get used to how you need to study. Anyway, one of the things that's gotten really much, much better since I went to college is the food services. Now look at this. Here is a cafeteria, or maybe it's one of the cafeterias on a campus. They're really awesome. And check this out. Here's the vegan section. Um, yeah, no one's there. Okay, anyway, so let's do a problem about college, college campus life, and um, your meal plan. Okay. Let's say that your university took a survey, and they found out that 56% of the students live on campus. We're going to call that event L living on campus, and they found out that 62% have a meal plan. We're going to call that event M. And 42 live on campus and have a meal plan. They do both. This presents a problem. This would mean that in this bubble here, 104% uh, of the students have a meal plan. Okay, so if we remember, we need to subtract that 42 from both of these things. Okay, so let me do that. So that looks a little bit better. We still have 56% um, there living on campus. We still have 62% uh, having a meal plan and 42 have both. That does not add up to 100%. So to make it 100%, um, we have 24% of the students that don't live on campus and they don't have a meal plan. So they're like commuter students, I guess you would say. Okay, so let's take a look at this question. While dining in a campus facility open only to students with meal plans, you meet someone interesting. What is the probability that your new acquaintance lives on campus? Hmm. So here we have the situation. Given that they have a meal plan, right, because you met them in the cafeteria, what's the probability that they live on campus? Okay. So, um, and here's our formula that I was trying to get to today. So, provided that they have a meal plan, what's the probability that they live on campus? Right here. So we take... Well, what's the probability that they have a meal plan and live on campus divided by the probability that they have a meal plan? So let me plug in those numbers. Let's see. A meal plan and live on campus. So that's going to be right here. Okay. And then the probability that they have a meal plan is this total right here. Okay. Let me plug in those numbers and see what we get. And there you have it. So you have a, almost a 68% chance that if someone is you, you sit down with somebody at the cafeteria, that they live on campus. There you go. It's a great icebreaker to make a new friend when you go to college.